Welcome back, you guys. Here, I picked up this project not too long ago. Thousand bucks. The paint was horrible. Um, I'll go ahead and put a couple pictures in. But this is a 98 Honda Civic if you're unfamiliar with this car. Today we're going to be shooting a single stage on it. Uh, I wish it could be two stage, but whatever. So let's go ahead and get started finally cleaning it up. We hit it with 600 grit all around. So the car's ready, sanded. It's as smooth as a baby's full temp. Yeah. <laughs> but it's dirty as hell, so let's go ahead and clean it up. Oh, yes. Oh, my gosh. Let's uh, turn this off real quick. And as, as you can tell, everything is masked up, ready to go. Floor's ready. You know, they say put a team together. Have the team follow your inspiration. Well, you do, well, you Look at my inspires. <laughs> Besides this guy, he's a little grouchy right now. I ain't doing anything. I'm recording. Yeah. This is your job. I don't see you asking anything. It's okay. And this is supposed to be your car, you know what you're saying? It's, it's, it's our car, David. Yeah. It's our car. I don't know about that. I don't want to argue with David no more. He's too mad. But the car's looking great. We already got it all washed up. Oh, wait, let me, excuse me. I got it all washed up. You feel me? Washed. Next, uh, everything's going to get masked, and then the whole car's going to get hit with wax and grease remover. And then we should be ready to start mixing up some paint. So uh, before I get in trouble by my supervisor, we'll finish masking up here and then uh, get it moved in. I'm kind of thinking of doing it like some type of like sideways because we had it straight and there's enough space towards the back end, but towards the front, it's just way too close to the door and I don't think I'll have the leverage to spray it correctly. So we'll see if we can maybe finesse it to go sideways. We'll see. And uh, everything's, you know, I'm pretty much ready to paint. Um, I'm shooting at 30 PSI and it's a single stage. Uh, single stage uh, glossy black so hopefully it turns out for the best once again 30 uh, 30 psi and then of course uh, with single stage rumors say that it's supposed to be a 75% overlap instead of a 50 by uh, a 50% overlap um, because you do have to hit, uh, layer it uh, a little thicker but I'm basically gonna go around I want to show the the places that are showing primer I want to touch up uh, before I actually get started painting so we're gonna go ahead and throw you on a time lapse and uh, wish me luck. Hopefully everything turns out great. <laughs>
So we laid down the first coat and man, oh man, look at that. That sh it's that shit is wet, boy. Look at that. Hi, hi. I'm super proud of the, the way this paint is coming out. Unfortunately, the the hood does have crow's feet, and I didn't sand it all the way down. Um, but you know, unfortunately, that's a flaw that's gonna have to stay. Um, other than that, I mean, geez, Louise, this shit with the first coat is already looking immaculate. Uh, there's like some areas I still have to go over again. I mean, for for the first coat, look at that. That shit looks insane. I'm like super amazed on how freaking good this shit looks. Uh, look at that. This is uh, the other side. And man, it's it's going great, you guys. We're gonna go ahead and let this uh, dry a little bit. Um, look at that. Hi, how you doing? <laughs> Yo, black. Uh, Black, honestly, is my favorite color to paint. I do not know why, um, but you see, you can kind of see the hood is is not as clean as I would want it to be, but unfortunately, that's something that's just gonna have to be like that. Look at that, oh my gosh. It's like a glass, yo. How you doing? How you doing? Yo, I'm like, I'm shook, honestly, you guys. It, well worth it, and believe me, I painted several cars with uh, Rust-Oleum, and, um, it doesn't do the justice like this single stage man this single stage is looking great but enough said we're gonna go ahead and do uh, another coat i'm gonna wait for this to dry for probably like five ten more minutes um and then we're gonna do another two coats we're gonna do a medium heavy and then i'm doing it uh 75 percent overlap so so yeah i mean it's pretty awesome the only thing i, I i'm not liking is that uh using the mask it's kind of giving me a little bit of anxiety, like claustrophobic, I guess. But you know what? It, it's better than actually inhaling those vapors. So wish me luck on the next coat, you guys. I think it's going to come out amazing. Honestly, I'm super proud, even, you know, whether it does or not. So I'll catch you on the next clip. And what do you know? We're done. So, unfortunately, unfortunately, so I kind of fucked up. So I'm gonna be honest with you guys. And there she goes, she's done. We got a couple of drips here and then the back of the trunk kind of came out kind of crappy. The, the stupid gun decided to mess up. Uh, it was spitting out too much air and not enough material. So it definitely looks really hazy here. I'm gonna see if I can uh, actually polish it out. But for, for the most part, it looks, it looks okay. It looks okay, it's not perfect. Um, you have to figure, this is technically my first car painting single stage. So I'm not too uh, too mad at it. You know, it could have been better. Unfortunately, I wasn't prepared as much as I, I would like to be. Um, but I'm happy with it. Overall, I'm pretty happy with it. This is probably my favorite side right here. Because this side came out phenomenal. I'm really, 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 really happy with this side. Um, but the other side, as you can tell, kind of messed up. But look at this side. I mean, come on. You can see, like, my reflection 100%. So, I mean, definitely, definitely happy with this side. Uh, not so much with the other side. But we're pretty much done here. We're going to go ahead and uh, clean everything up. I'm, I'm going to wrap up this video here. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know down in the comment sections what you think. Um, any tips and tricks, I'm always, you know, mindful towards those. So, yeah, catch you guys on the next one.